the Louis Van and David. Hello, good evening. Good How evening. are you? Good, and you? I'm fine. And a little bit nervous because the earthquake. Ah, uh, yes, today we had quite a few uh, earthquakes and some, and I felt one replica. Good evening. Yeah, me too. Good evening. Good evening. That's very strong in my place. Wow. I felt that it was strong because but some people say 6.7. No, yes, yes. yes. 6.7 is, is a little bit strong. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not so strong to cause damage, but it's enough that you start to worry and you say, Ooh, maybe. Mm -hmm. Move that. It moves the TV, the dishes, things like this. Okay. Xiomara, how are you? Hi, teacher. Um, well, some scared about the earthquake. Uh... Uh, we felt very strong. We were in the third level and the company I was working that at that time. Uh, we were very scared of it. Yes, because when you are higher in the building, you feel it more. Yes. yes Richard, one, one question. Yes. Temblor is it's <laughs> earthquake too. No. Temblor is a tremor. Tremor. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Thank you. And the earthquake is terremoto. I guess there's a technical, a technicality, right? I think earthquakes have to be 7.0 or more. We 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 had a a tremor. A tremor. Few, a tremor. A tremor. Uh huh. Tremor. A few moments ago. Yes. Yes, because here uh, I I don't remember specifically, but usually earthquakes are stronger. It's only like um I don't know if it's seven or seven point five or more is an earthquake. And I then think it's seven. Seven. And then less than that is only a tremor, yeah. A tremor because In seven is an earthquake. Yes, because a seven can cause damage, but less than a we seven, were no damage. we were almost to that. <laughs> Almost one minute, one minute more, and maybe right. <laughs> exactly, yeah. exactly. Floyd, how is your baby? Uh, your baby is okay today. You can participate. Good morning. Well, uh, good evening, teacher. Sorry. Good evening. Good evening. It's <laughs> I okay. lost in the time. It's okay. My baby Flor. is ill, <laughs> sick. He yes. is with fever. Ah, uh, could your baby continue with fever, Floor? Yes. Oh, sorry to hear that. But I can participate only if he is crying. I, I believe that I won't, won't do that. No problem. Okay, it's great. No problem, Floyd. Okay. All right. So today we're gonna go ahead and continue. We were looking at yesterday about gestures. Do you remember gestures? Yes. Yes, gestures and feelings and emotions and many different things like that. So today we're going to go ahead and describe a little bit. Um, we're going to talk about different emotions. Hey, Daniel, welcome. All right, we got everybody ready. So as an example, um, the last time, when was the last time that you were angry or happy or scared? Okay, and what did you do? Let's start with the easy one. Tell me about the last time you were happy. To whom was the question? Tell me about the last time that you were happy. Well, today in the afternoon. Okay. What happened? I... Uh, me salió bien el trabajo. Oh, so you did My, a good job. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah, that's it. And what did you do? Well, I already made 
making keychains, one special keychain for Honduras, one for one school of Honduras. And it's very hard because the keychains have a different colors and is grabado. I, I don't remember. Engraved. I think, mm -hmm. well, depends yeah, on the material, but uh-huh. Engraved. Yes, it's, it's engraving the material, and then mm -hmm. first I engrave, and then I paint it, it with many colors, the kitchens, and I need to polish them. So today I make the middle part, and the middle part is good. I is expect to tomorrow the next step will be good. So is... Uh, do you work in wood, David? No, in metal. In, in metal. metal. Ah, okay. In okay. Uh, bronze, I don't remember, but, but it's not, but it's not copper. No, it's bronze. It's bronze, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the kitchen is going to be made in bronze. Yeah. Okay. It's like a metal. Okay. What is kitchen? Gavero. No, kitchen is cocina. Oh, okay. kitchen. So, uh, so, uh huh. I think you want to say keychain. A keychain. A okay. keychain. Yes. Okay. Yes. I was thinking, wow, big kitchen. I think, mm, okay, but yes, <laughs> okay. exactly, keychain. Okay. Ah. Keychain. Keychains. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Ah, so you make them out of bronze. Bronze, gold, silver. Okay, very nice. Aluminium, David. yeah. Hey, pretty good. And you can design anything on them. Yes, I'm designing first in the computer and then I pass to the um, laser machine to mm -hmm. make the, the, the original piece. And then I make the mold and mold. mold I the mold, know. yes. Yeah, I make them all and then I produce many pieces. Okay, okay. Like for the school that you are making. So it's like for their anniversary or something. Yes, I think. Yes. Yes. Normally that's what they use it for, for to have some kind of... Uh, yeah, special. Yeah, some kind of... It's not normal just to a normal uh, name for the school or something like that. Okay. So similar, that's the same thing you're going to do. Uh, what we're going to do is ask our partners different types of questions. We have many different questions that we can ask. Here, I'm also, we want to talk about emotions and feelings. So you're going to ask your partner any emotion that you want. Um, tell me about the last time that you were scared uh, afraid, embarrassed, happy, you know, excited, amazed, whatever question you want to ask them, that is the idea for the person to be able to express themselves and how they felt. And then, of course, the details. What happened? Why did they feel that way? Similar to the example that we just did. Any questions before we make our groups? We are going to send the questions, so we oh, no, are going, going to ask to the questions. Mm -hmm. ah, okay. Mm -hmm. You're going to ask the question depending on your group. What, what for you is more interesting? If you want to talk about uh, scared or happiness or sadness or amazement or whatever you want. Okay. No questions? Then let's do it.
Carla, you having problems connecting? Lord, you have problems connecting? Excuse me, teacher, I didn't hear. Lord, do you have problems connecting? Yes. I always that I have to join another, in another room. I have to quit the, the main page of Zoom. Mm -hmm. And then I, I have to connect again. Okay. It's a I, it's an internet problem then. I think it's my cell phone. Uh, yes. Because if you connect from the cell phone, is some cell phones is only possible one window. Some cell phones you have to have if you have to open another window, they close the original. Yes, it's true. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay. Don't worry. And what is your baby's name, Flor? My baby's name is Karen Emilio. Karen. It's a no, girl. Karen. No, Karen. Ah, Kevin. Kevin Emilio. Yes. Okay. Why Kevin? No, it's Karen. Why Karen? Because I worked in the Escuela Americana like six years ago. Mm -hmm. And I was in the cafeteria. I met a boy that studied there. It was very friendly with me. Mm -hmm. His name was Kering. And I liked that name when I said, when I have a baby boy, I'm going to call like that guy. <laughs> That's why <laughs> it was a friend of me. Okay, very interesting. And you don't work in the American school anymore? No, because uh, they, they closed the cafeteria when I had my other daughter because my first daughter mm -hmm. is six years. When I have to return to my job, when I finish my maternity, I don't know how they say. Yes, maternity. maternity exactly. They mm -hmm. tell me that we don't have to go to school Americana anymore. I was very sad because I worked there there around 10 years. Really, Floyd? Yes. Hmm. I don't know if you worked there. I don't, I yes. maybe. I worked there and I'm trying to, re I don't remember you, Floyd. And I was in the teacher, in the teacher cafeterias. Yes, I worked there many years. Flor, let me see your face. <laughs> in this moment, I am in the bed with my baby. Okay, Flor. In a different day, in a different day, I'm going to see if I remember you. Mm -hmm. Now I am very different because when I was working there, I was very, very skinny. Mm -hmm. Now I I earn some points, but not much, like 20 points more. Okay, from the baby, right? Yes, for my two babies. Okay, okay. Yeah, I, work, I worked work in, for like yes. 10 years, for almost 10 years. It was in extension, extension. Yes, I also worked in TLC also. Yes, because your face. I worked in both. I remember your face, but I'm not sure. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. Well, good. So now we have the ideas. We're discussing our emotions with our partners. We have it. Today, we're going to go ahead and continue with the second part. Um, yesterday, we learned a little bit about some modal verbs. If you remember, like uh, can, may, might, probably. Today, we're going to be learning about using the permission, prohibition, and obligation, the different models for these. Let's take a look. Hi, let me ask you a question. Are you allowed to drink and drive? This time we'll talk about permission, prohibition, and obligation. So stay around for the explanation. Permission, obligation, and prohibition. Permission. You can camp here. 
You're allowed to take off your shoes. Obligation. You have to camp here. You've got to take off your shoes. Prohibition. You can't camp here. You aren't allowed to take off your shoes. Okay, so first things, let's take a look at those three different things. One is permission, one is obligation, and one is prohibition. First, do we understand the difference between permission, obligation, and prohibition? Yes. Yes? Okay. Yes. Good. So prohibition is, is not permitted, right? It's not correct. Yep. Obligation is you have to. It's not option. Is necessity. And then permission is you can do it if you ask for it or it's okay. Let's take a look at all of the different ones that we use. Permission, we use can. Prohibition, we use can't. Permission, we use allowed to. Prohibition, we use aren't allowed to. Those are the ones that are the two ranges that are very easy. And then obligations is have to or have got to. Both have the same meaning. Have to or got to. When we talk about permission, we will use can or be allowed to. For example, you can park here. He's allowed to stay up late. We will use can't and not be allowed to for prohibition. He can't smoke in the lobby. They're not allowed to answer the phone. If you notice, it's the opposite of our permission usage. Finally, we have obligation. For obligation, have to or have got to are used. You have to pay rent. He's got to pick up the trash. Write one example for permission, obligation, and prohibition with real information about you. What can you do? What are you allowed to do? And what do you have to do? Don't forget to write your examples on our discussion box. Okay. So we're going to take that topic, those ideas, and we're going to discuss about your work, your job, or your work. So, for example, in your job, what can you do? What do you have to do? And what you are not allowed to do? Okay, so think about your daily job. What can you do? Well, in my case, I can, uh, I can take off any day that I want. I only have to uh, send a message and explain that I can't give the class. Oh, but I have to explain everything in English. Okay, that's my obligation. Or I've got to explain everything in English. Okay. Uh, my prohibition is I can't use Spanish very often. I can only use Spanish a little bit in specific situations. So now we're going to talk about your job and what are your responsibilities? What can you do? What do you have to do? What can't you do? Okay. These are the same ideas. The things that we're going to talk about, permission, obligation, and prohibition. Any questions, any vocabularies to describe your job or the activities in your job? Approved, teacher. Okay. So the easy way up, I see Daniel has a question. Yes, Daniel? Yeah, teacher, I have a little question about with the pronunciation of the the word prohibition mm -hmm. because in the video the 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 missus says prohibition that's correct or prohibition so i can go prohibition. let me prohibition. listen prohi let's yeah. take, let me take a look let's see it one more time yeah you're allowed let's... to take off your shoes right this time we'll talk about permission, prohibition, and obligation. Ah, yes, you're right. She says prohibition, prohibition, Pro but it's prohibition. prohibition. Mm -hmm. And what is the correct uh, form to say prohibition? Prohibition. Pro no H. The, it's like, it's not a strong H. It's prohibition. 
prohibition. Okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. You're welcome, Daniel. Okay. So we're going to talk about your job, what you can, can't do, and what you have to do. Any questions? Anything that you want to mention about your job? You're not sure how to say in English? Me, teacher. Yes. Uh, for permission, I I can have my coffee next to me anytime too. Correct. I can drink. Uh, Good. Yes. And my obligation is um, to finish all my assignments in my labor day. I okay. can go without finishing. More or less, more or less. I remember the obligation is have to. So I have to finish. I have to, exactly. So you're going to say, I have to finish. I and have for to the finish. Purpose. And for permission, for example, in your job, Hey, I am allowed to have coffee at my desk. I can, I can, I am a, allowed to take a, 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 a beverage or coffee next to me to, or some snack. Yes, exactly. Uh -huh. Remember, yeah. we can use can or allowed to, they have the same meaning, permission. Yes. And my prohibition is not to have my cell phone next to me. We... All, all of us um, let the phone in another place because we are in the area very strict with a lot of imp important information and we, we can use it inside the, the area. So what is the correct grammar, Xiomara? What is the correct grammar? You explained, but you didn't use the vocabulary. Uh, I can't use my phone when exactly. I'm working. Exactly. Super easy. <laughs> Yes, that's the idea. That's the function of the models to make complex sentence super easy. You don't have to explain it when the moment you say can't, I know that it's not permitted. The moment you say have to, I know it's an obligation. The moment that you say allowed to, I know it's a permission. You don't have to say, oh, tengo el permiso. De you don't have to because the moment you say the word can't, the listener is automatic because that is the meaning. Okay, teacher. Okay, great. Any other questions? No? Okay, let's make our small groups and let's work on it. Where? Yes? Okay. My in my work, I usually I have to take a note about the orders for the customers and and to I have to keep um customers sat satisfied with my product and um, always I have to maintain uh, clean, clean, cleanliness and production quality because the people is very uh, pretty complicated and um, and um, sometimes I cannot um, descuidar, uh, no, I, I don't know 
what to say, what, I, I don't know to say descuidar in English, but I, I am, um, I cannot, the Brits Burns. <laughs> yes. But um, on a, we need to stay to, what do you say, atentos? Excuse me? How do you say atentos? Or watch, or I, I don't know. Focused. I don't know. Focus, focus. And uh, ah. with, the, with the camera, that, oh, this is a, a, a big change. <laughs> Okay, uh, Daniel, could you tell me what in your in your work or in your job? I don't know. What is allowed to or the prohibition? Um, I can. I can't have my cell phone with me when I'm working. <laughs> uh, yes, that's very uh, stressing because of yes <laughs> we we need to see some message and we can't <laughs> and no <there> is permission <laughs> no and I have to finish my assignments too to the end of my discussion oh yeah, yeah. and your your job what is your job I am, I am a customer service. I oh. I have to attend. I have to attend many customers and typificar a very. How do you say? Um, Un to see español. many to see to see many information about the the client. Uh, oh. the computer good, uh, good. we have to introduce computer introduce information to the computer too and we have to let uh, evidence what we do with what we did with the client oh good good i have a i have a dream it, it is a, it's like a, my big permission for my life I wanna, I wanna speak English very well. I wanna talk in English very well because I want uh, to work in another place. U B R I S Y. In another place, uh, I think in a, a call center because it's este es bien pagado. <laughs> English, bilingual. Sí, uh, bilingual, full yes. bilingual. Yeah, I I think I think uh, we we gonna do it. We gonna have a, a, a success with this course. Yeah. I have some friends in that place still working. The some mm -hmm. of them are single, uh, and they can be any time to any schedule. And sure. I I'm not available for any schedule. <laughs> Oh, well. Yeah. That's, uh, yeah. That's it. So, I don't know if you can. What do you? What are you allowed to do with your nephew? Uh, may you repeat, please? What are you allowed to do with your nephew? ¿Qué es lo que puedes hacer con tu sobrino, sobrina? I teach them to, I teach her to speak because uh, she has two years old. Okay. <laughs> And what you are not allowed to do with her? <laughs> That... She, uh, use, she she can use my computer without my my, my permission. 
Oh. Okay. I don't know if you have some question, you or Flor. I don't know. Um, you want to know something, something else? No. What? What obligations do you have in your home and in your work or your house? <laughs> well, I in my work I have to to make my they can. Pedido, my okay good so now we get the idea of how to use these different models in the chat, we're going to have three exercises that we need to complete. The links are being posted right now, and the ideas are to use three different types of models. We're going to practice all of the ones that we have learned and to make sure that it's clear. So we're going to practice models with uh, must, okay, and have to. We are practice models with can, could, able to. And we're going to practice models with uh, the same idea for would or be able to. So we have the three. Okay. So we have the models with must not, do not have to. We have the models with can, could, and be able to. And then, of course, we use the models with would. It's okay, the three links. Teacher, I just check the 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 first one, the second one. Yes, remember to open the links before we go to the groups. That way, they don't disappear on you. Because when we go to the groups, they usually disappear. Okay, are we ready now? Okay, we have 10 minutes to complete the three links with our partner. 10 minutes, okay. the three links. Okay. Let me take a I, I share the, the picture with you in the in most not doesn't have two. You don't have okay. two. So the computer yes. by it's a let's start with it. 
Yes, and yeah, I think. Uh, yeah, for the next, the, or this is for you the first. Okay. Sure. Uh, you can do this one more question. Uh, yes. Cool. He understand what you were talking about. Cool. 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 The first one. Mm -hmm. Cool. Yes. Cool. My sister came to play tennis now. My sister can. Can. My sister can play tennis now. It's present. Mm-hmm. It's a, a permission. Uh, I I could. I could. Yes, I could. I could well when I was less than a year. You must. Must not. Let me see. Let me see. You must not be late for class. Wait. Ah, el primero. Yes. You. Wait. You must not. Mustn't. Must. I think it's a letter B. Yes. Number two. Oh, yeah. This bus is free. Is it not? You don't have to buy a ticket. You don't have to. You don't... Uh, exam. Um, yeah. Yes, I think it's B. I think. B -B. Yeah, I think the same. Yes. Okay, it's correct. Okay, number five is the bus is free. You don't have to buy a ticket or you mustn't buy a ticket. The bus is free. The, the, the you don't the have order. to buy a ticket. You don't have to. You don't have to. Okay. Yes. Number six. The first one, I think. Yeah, the first one. For me, the no. first one. He, I, I don't know, the apostrophe, <laughs> just D, it's how. Yes. He has, okay. Yes, he I, said I, that I, he had helped me. He I, would know, help I, me. I think, I think the apostrophe is the contraction about the wood. I, I think, yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Because the other, it doesn't have sense. He would too. Yes, yeah, the first uh, has to be. I guess the, the first one is, is correct. Yes. Yeah. Letter three. What do you think? In my case, I can't see the 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 answers. Just you, a question. Being able to. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, I, I can help you there. The same, be able to. Um, un montón de be able to. Again? Again? I'll, Again, no, be, be able to. Because we don't, we can put two models. I will, I will, I will. No, mm -hmm. no podemos poner I will can. Mm -hmm. To be able and I can. Vamos con be able. <laughs> well, <team Marie. laughs> <laughs> can you help me? I cannot, never understand. Can you help me? I can because it's an I animal. cannot. People, the other ones. Okay, the first one, it says, um, I think it's cold. Could he understand what you were talking about? Yeah, I think. Yes. My sister played tennis now. 
no veo los de abajo. Ahorita, ahorita, ahorita. Entonces es, you don't have to. Se va muy arriba. Ahí está. My sister came to play tennis. No, no, can, no, can, can, can. And you have to camp here. You've got to. Hi, let me ask you a question. Are you allowed to drink and drive? This I will talk about permission, prohibition, and obligation. So stay around for the explanation. Permission, obligation, and prohibition. Permission. Hi, let me ask you a question. Are you allowed to drink and drive? This time we'll talk about permission, prohibition, and obligation. So stay around for the explanation. Permission, obligation, and prohibition. Permission. You can camp here. You're allowed to take off your shoes. Obligation. You have to camp here. You've got to take off your shoes. Prohibition. You can't camp here. You aren't allowed to take off your shoes. When we talk about permission, we will use can or be allowed to. For example, you can park here. It's allowed to stay up late. We will use can't and not be allowed to for prohibition. He can't smoke in the lobby. They are not allowed to answer the phone. If you notice, it's the opposite of our permission usage. Finally, we have obligation. For obligation, have to or have got to are used. You have to pay rent. He's got to pick up the trash. Write one example for permission, obligation, and prohibition with real information about you. What can you do? What are you allowed to do? And what do you have to do? Don't forget to write your examples on a discussion box. Okay, was that a little bit better? Did it help you understand a little bit more can and could be able to, must, mustn't? Yes, any yeah, questions? This is, a, this is a good exercise because um, I try to answer only the must and the have to, but um in the first part we must to uh, and i assign uh, what is the answer for the correct but the next seven answer a uh, question i think what's easy okay good good the idea is only to give you a little bit more practice on how to use it and what to describe okay so now we're going to try together ah Hey, good, Carla. I see the answers were correct. Very nice. Okay. So now we're going to try together. We're going to try to complete the exercise that we have here. We have a picture, okay? Or several pictures. Tell me, what do you think those pictures mean? What do they represent? For example, letter A, what do you think is letter A? The prohibition. 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 And what is it? What What do you think is the message? Don't open Don't the window. Don't drink or eat anything. No, no eating and no drinking. Okay. So, no, yes. So, don't eat or drink anything. Okay. Good. What about letter B? What do you think is letter B? 
turn off turn off the the light turn off the lights okay turn off the lights man that's good what about letter c the, it's a prohibition pet. no pets no pets presently say is no pet friendly okay yeah no pet friendly exactly no allowed to pet it's mm -hmm. not allowed so dogs are not allowed right that's the idea okay in letter d maybe close the door ah, okay so you, you must close the door Keep... maybe maybe door. what about letter e what's letter e now open the door the window please okay so so open opening the window then open the way ah, okay and where do you think you can see that where where what message where would you find that message don't open the windows prohibition yes but where in what place in what place could you find that in the uh, in airplane in the, the, bus, the bus the bus in the bus most likely the bus an airplane probably impossible mm -hmm. in the high in the high building okay the high building mm -hmm. yeah. good what about letter f where can we what is letter f You take the insurance to the bike by a chain or a, or the other thing to um what do you say asegurar insurance okay. maybe to secure mm -hmm. to look bikes in the bike right bike rack rack by rack like in your place like a bike rack right or a place to park your bike. Mm -hmm. yeah. Here in El Salvador, we have a few places like this. In Very, the parks? There in is. the park, Paseo El Carmen, San Juan Opico, all of these areas. For me, I see this a lot in San Juan Opico. It's the place where I see most than anywhere in El Salvador. Hmm. What about letter G? Throw Use the, the trash, trash. Don't trash. Okay. Put trash in a basket. Put okay. the trash in the basket. Put the trash in the basket. Good. Exactly. Throw, throw, throw teacher, the trash. Throw the trash in the in the garbage, or throw the garbage in the trash. <laughs> and what about letter H? What would be letter H? No football permitted. Oh, okay. So no football, no playing with balls. No playing football. No playing. Yeah. It's not about to play football. Yeah, it's not permitted, right? Not very often. So as you can see, we have very common in our lives, many places. We have provisions. We have permissions. We have different areas. When you go to the pool, you have some pools that say no jumping. No jumping in the pool, right? Others have no running. Depend the place. Not running. Yeah. Uh -huh. Depend the place. No smoking, teacher. No smoking. Ah, no smoking. Yes. It's another. Mm -hmm. But now the people don't smoke. Now the people vape. This is the idea. Wait, food. Wait, food, teacher. With the vape, they, the big smoke. Mm hmm. Good. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and before we finish off this, we're going to select a topic here. I'm going to give you a link. One moment. Okay, it's in the chat um, with your partners. You can choose any topic and select, and then we're just going to practice our speaking for a few moments. First, open the link. Make sure that you have access. It's okay. Mm 
Okay, Hector, ask me a question. Okay, teacher, let me see. Okay, have you ever sit in the sun? Have I ever? Have you ever cheated in an exam? Ah, have I ever cheated on an exam? Yes, Hector, I've cheated on an exam many times. Um, it was very common when I was in school. I was very intelligent and I helped my friends. I would give them the answer so that way they didn't study and I would help them uh, to pass the classes. But mm -hmm. what is mean cheating, teacher? Ah, anybody know what is cheated? What is cheated? Copiar. There you go. Hacer trampa. Cheated on the exam. Okay. Okay. So, like Hector and me, select any questions and then you ask and answer each other different topics. Yes? Yeah. Select another, another people. Okay. Let's go with other people. Uh, tell me, when is the holiday celebrate for you, Hector? Uh, holiday what celebrate is for me is the Mondays because okay. for me more, more important because the mother is very uh, important. Um, in, I, I think, okay. Um, in my case, I yes. don't have, I don't have, I don't have time for sharing with my with my family or with my friends because always I'll talk about. Okay, I'm going to ask you, have you ever traveled to another country? Yes, I have traveled to Costa Rica, to Colombia, to Nicaragua. No, lo siento, I'm sorry, no puedo. Gisela, you can or you can neither. Tengo el link. But you don't have to share the screen. Only you have to ask the question and answer. Okay. Everybody can have different topics. It's no problem. Okay, Tumara, you can see your link. You want to... Here, I put in the chat again, that way you can see. If you don't, check the chat and you can have the link again. We have to talk about any topic. Yes, Yomara, any topic. You select the topic and ask the partner, ask Ivan and ask Gisela. Okay, Ivan and Gisela, okay. uh, what can you uh, say about your hobbies? What is your hobby and your free time? What do you do? Okay, in my case, my hobby is uh, 
we're making pizza and some read some books. Mm -hmm. I like reading some books and check the the my platform. In this case, when we are studying English, but in uh, general, uh, uh, right with my motorcycle, I have a motorcycle. I uh -huh. like my motorcycle. <laughs> yeah, when I Yamaha de the motorcycle. Uh, I like. Me gusta salir un rato. And how about Gisela? What is your hobby or your hobbies? Uh, my hobby in my free time is are the first is watch the K dramas and and I listen to music. Mm -hmm. Yes, that. Como se diría pasar tiempo. Spend the time. Spend the time. Ah, entonces sería I spend the time with my mom. Uh -huh. And you? Congratulations. Oh, well, uh, I like to to listen uh, to the to music and rest sleep because I uh, almost the day in in activity. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, what else? Uh, Ivan and Gisela, what do you like when so uh, for gifts? What um, if I if you receive a gift, but you expect about the gift could be. A gift, uh, gift for, uh, for... for example, in the holidays of Christmas, we oh, yeah, receive yeah, see. many gifts. Yeah. So receive or just... give, receive or give, or and, give. And just guess you are going to uh, receive a gift. So uh, what yeah. do you want? What am I? Uh, do you want to give and what do you like to receive? receive. In my case, I, I like the tennis for basketball. Mm. I like very, very much the tennis, Nike oh. or, or Adidas. Oh, I like okay. it my tennis. I, 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 it's, it's my. My obsession. <laughs> uh, in my, I have a, I have a sixteen years old, and yet I use uh, tennis. I like tennis. It's very, very, very nice. And give uh, and and what? What do you want give, to give for someone? Um, Christmas and Christmas. In Christmas, Christmas, if it is a woman or and if it is a man, what do you want to give? I in Christmas, uh, um, lo que me pida. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> no, I am, am, I like it a perfume. Yes. A, a good perfume is a, a good gift. Yes. In any occasion. Will be este birthday or or Christmas is a good gift, a good perfume. Perfume. Yeah, that's a good option. Yes, it's a good option. Yes. Yeah, and how about bien. you, Gisela? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I like it. <laughs> <laughs> It's so, you, Gisela, what do you want to give and what do you like to receive? It? Mm. I don't know. 
Don't you like the shoes? Uh, sorry? I, I like... A good food? I like to receive... Food. <laughs> better person. But I don't know... Un in particular. In particular. Le sí me gusta recibir regalos, pero es que no tengo uno en particular. Ok. Okay, guys. Very good. That's the idea. The idea is for us to get a little bit better speaking. I know that sometimes it's the most difficult, right? The most difficult part is uh, how to speak and what to say. Sometimes we have no idea. That's why we need to practice. So thank you so much for connecting. We're going to continue practicing using models. Tomorrow we're going to have... Teacher, continue an hour tomorrow. Yes, tomorrow we continue another hour. <laughs> <laughs> so, thank you so much for connecting, guys. Tomorrow we continue practicing. Remember, the important is speak and speak and speak. If you have no idea, create the idea. Create, because if you don't speak, always, what are you going to say? Um, e que no sé, que, e que no. And then never you're going to develop your English. So, if you have to invent, invent it, make it up. Create it. Give an answer. This is the best way to improve your English. To improve your English, the best way is by making, by making sentences. All right. Have a great night. Okay. Thank teacher. you so much. Thank, Thank you, guys. teacher. All right. Bye, bye. 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 Bye.